welcome to pnk stocks youtube channel as tomorrow is diwali so let us let us pick diwali picks what is the significance of picking stocks on diwali whether market is up down sideways the main our culture is to earn at least 1 rupee from diwali to diwali will shower lord lakshmi in our lives so i pray lord lakshmi to give wealth to all my subscribers including me and those who are subscribing my channel and also watching my channel regularly let us now see <coughs> we'll pick stocks for this diwali and uh, see that how these stocks will work till next diwali the performance that will gauge so lot of lot of advisory people are selling stock picking ideas from 5000 to 5 lakhs nowadays on diwali moment as our channel is free of cost so let us now we pick 10 stocks and see how these 10 stocks will perform till next diwali so you can exit these stocks any time if you have the desired percentage that you are looking or else you can hold till next diwali and exit them now mainly how to pick stocks that is the crucial thing <clears throat> whether you need all large cap stocks or mid cap stocks or small cap stocks how we need to pick stocks that is the key thing here i'll give an example a 30 year person say now lifetime is 100 years so 100 minus 30 is 70 so you can take 70% risk to invest on small caps and mid caps similarly a 70 years person want to invest then 100 minus 70 30% so he can invest 30% in small caps and mid caps rest all 70% in large caps why it so large cap stocks are nifty 50 stocks they are very large and they are all made their benchmark to giving returns from ages so if in any condition these stocks doesn't fall that much similarly these stocks doesn't give even that kind of a return say now if you take a small cap stock that stock will hit upper circuit you know upper circuit in the sense the upper circuit limit could be 5% 10% 20% whatever small caps and mid cap stocks they can hit the upper circuit but not the large cap stock so hope you understand now if a 50 years person need to invest then choose five stocks from large cap stocks and rest five stocks from mid cap stocks and you need to invest equal proportion say now you want to invest 10 lakhs then put 10 lakhs in each one of the stock in the same capacity now you know diwali picks are different from wealth creation or positional tradings this is separate segment where you are taking some portion of your capital and investing on diwali time for particular amount of money to the specified stocks and we are praying lord lakshmi to shower her blessings in these stocks to give it performance <clears throat> right now what kind of a performance that we need to look into these stocks now take an example now a bank interest rates come down to 5 to 6% now if your stocks performs four times to that at least 25% then you are king you know if you are investing 10 lakhs by end of the next diwali rls in between you find good profits then you are exiting so 25% profit in the sense investing 10 lakhs could be getting 12 lakhs 50000 right if you invest the same 10 lakhs in banks you are getting only 60000 rupees all right now you understand the concept why we are investing in diwali time because you invest even 10000 or even 2000 rupees whatever you know stock price should be you are getting all 10 stocks into 
200 rupees that won't possible so minimum 10,000 could be ideal to invest in this all right then now the second thing how much capital you need to put in again depends on you whatever capital that you are comfortable now once you invest what you need to do now we are hearing every week every day some kind of a bad news across the world iran is att attacking syria syria is attacking iran us is supporting some other country all these news are getting very bad bad information and markets are falling why markets are falling FIIs are taking money from our Indian equity and they are putting money from other countries. These FIIs, foreign institute investors, they will revolve the world and they will putting their money in different different countries. Till now they prefer India is the best country and you know economically India is growing country. That is the reason lot of FIIs put the money in India. But some other countries also come up to India level and they have some kind of a additional advantages where their uh, economy will grow even better than India. That is the reason. Last two months, FIAs are taking money from India and putting that money back in some other countries. But he, here it won't stop now. They will come back again in India and all these things will happen. But the bad news, you know, any kind of a bad news like Corona, election bad news or any stuff will affect market. So once you invest, then what you need to do? <clears throat> How much risk you need to take? Take an example. Now I'm, let us assume as an example that for Diwali picks, I'm putting 10 lakhs rupees. That means I'm choosing 10 stocks, not one stock. I'm choosing 10 stocks and uh, dividing my 10 lakhs capital into 1 lakh into each stock take an example what i do now if market falls and my entire portfolio not one stock or two stocks combining all 10 stocks total loss i am getting 25000 then i am exiting and if my portfolio is green i'll be holding till next diwali now, what kind of a stocks that I am choosing? Because I am in the market last 15 years, I find more value in small caps and mid caps than large caps that we already discussed. Because you people are new, so you need to invest as I said. You know, your age, 100 minus your age, whatever comes, that percentage you need to put into the large cap. Whatever left, taken 40 years, guy. 60% you can put on the, you know, 30% in small cap, 30% in mid cap and rest of the 40% in large cap. But myself, I am choosing couple of large cap stocks and few are mid cap stocks and few are small cap stocks. And I designed a portfolio and I am revealing that to you. Please, please, please. I am not a SEBI registered guy. I am not recommending these stocks to anyone. I am just showing these stocks to you to analyze them till next Diwali. And I am telling you that by next Diwali, I will make you to pick your own stocks which can perform more than 25%. I am telling, reiterating once again. I am just showing this portfolio to you. Now, I am not talking about why I pick this stock and what parameters that I pick these stocks. I am just showing my portfolio and slowly we will we'll work on how to pick the stocks. You need to look into fundamentals or you need to uh, look into technicals. As situation is you know not good in globally because a lot of wars are going on. So we need to choose fundamental good companies and uh, uh, best technical things. I'll give you an example now. You want to go to your hometown for Diwali. You want to board a bus. You find three buses are standing there and you want to board a bus. Tell me which bus you will board. First bus, total empty, none of them inside. You board that bus or second bus. There are 50% passengers, none of them. 
third bus there are 90% passengers and even driver is there and he started the bus which bus you board so we need to pick stocks accordingly fundamentally strong all buses are good they'll go to your destiny but all buses are good but technically this bus is already almost full even driver is sitting and bus again he started the bus to start in next two minutes so you need to pick this kind of a stocks so slowly we'll make lot of videos on fundamental analysis technical analysis how to pick the stocks what kind of a key parameters that we need to look in to get 25 percent 50 percent even multi bagger stocks hope you understand my intention my sincere suggestion just observation i am showing these stocks you should not even put in a single rupee in it let us now see the stocks now we have lot of sites where you know whether you buy or not but you can you can key in the information like that i keyed these 10 stocks putting this 1 lakh rupees in each stock i i i taken this after market hours so my total value is 10 lakhs and you know because of some fluctuation it shows something less to that around 350 rupees so these are the stocks that i put in so I'll be buying these stocks either tomorrow or on a, uh, Diwali's day one hour trading time that they give. So first stocks, Aeroflex Industries, Philatex India, Manampuram Finance. You may be thinking that this stock fallen last two weeks. NMDC, ONGC, Rajesh Exports, Sabu Sodium, TV Today. LNT Organics and uh, Walchen Nagar. These 10 stocks, few stocks are, you know, it's a large cap to mid cap kind of a stocks and few are small caps, few are uh, mid caps. So these 10 stocks I'll be having in my portfolio and I'm entering some amount of capital in this equal amount, whether you put 10,000 each or 1,000 each or 1 lakh each. I'm taking an example of 1 lakh each. I took these values after market hours. That means the amount, whatever I invested, almost them 350 rupees less because we brought some stocks, some more amount, some stock less amount. This is, you know, today's performance on these stocks, but this is not based on the our entry. So you can take this in readifmail.com where in the finance section you can have this portfolio or else money control. There are a lot of channels where you can, you know, put your stocks and see how they are performing. So we'll analyze these stocks, go forward basis, and I'll be explaining you not these stocks because this already will become a bit old when you know we are learning things. So what are the key parameters that we need to look into each stock to get into that stock? And how long we need to hold? Whether this stock has a potential to give 25%, 50%, 100%, never know now you know but these stocks have a potential now what will happen now after a week again iran syria war or else us again supports one of the countries then it will be other countries joining to the other uh, either iran or uh, iraq the war will be even severe but anyway we put in if entire portfolio comes down to 7.5 lakhs mine is 1 lakh that what we are showing 7.5 lakhs will be exiting all stocks this is most important somewhere you should have a stop loss if you don't have a stop loss then your capital may become zero that we should not want right now let us say now aeroflex industries minus 30 percent after four months we should exit yes no we should not exit right our intention is to main portfolio is less than 25 percent then only we'll be exiting these stocks you should understand this diwali to diwali pick probably i am into the field and i know if some stock is doing very bad then we'll be taking off this stock and we'll be putting another new stock in it or else if philatex industries gives 50 percent in next six months and i see this stock doesn't have a potential to give more then what i do i'll book this profit and 
50 percent in the sense my one lakh will become one and a half lakh then i'll be putting one and a half lakh into the new stock hope you understand but in general diwali to diwali we don't change stocks we'll be keeping stock as it is but still we can do that so we'll start learning how to pick these stocks and all so once again i'm not a sebi registered person you should not buy any one of the stock in this these stocks for only observation purpose so few of them are joined in my telegram channel so if you also join then we have some kind of a conversation i'll be giving updates if you are interested join there we have discussed about some of the stocks in this and then we thought of you know having the bunch of stocks for diwali this thing so if you interested join our telegram channel i'll be giving in the description section and uh, thank you and observe these stocks i'm uh, praying god lakshmi once again to shower wealth to all our members and also those who are watching my video thank you bye bye